Do you know what this is? Most of us here, if not every one of us, other than the new ones, know exactly what is our Incheway Sacha Energy Oil already, right? Now, the company didn't stop at that one product, okay? Because you know that the whole bottom line message is you drink good oil to expel bad oil. So, what we do is that we went on to do more R&D to look at the efficacy of other oils. Okay, and there about came oh, such a inchi plus. Okay, in this case we got balance. Why is it purple color? Because we added purple rice oil to it. Okay, and why I'm going to explain right now uh, as we go on. So we have right now we call balance. Okay, this one after this one after your initial period of taking such an oil, you can actually start to choose to use this for increased efficacy. Let's go on. And then there's also rich, which is rice bran and germ wheat oil. Okay, let's go on. This is Chinese name. I'll just jump to the main one. Huh? Now, the thing is this. In omega-3 and omega-6 rich saturated oil alone, of course, you got the best efficacy again. But there's also something that's called ORAC. Okay, this is uh, oxygen radical absorbance capacity. The ability of the food product, the ingredient, or in this case the oil, to absorb free radicals in your body. Okay, find out what exactly is free radicals. Free radicals in the body some, is, are basically free atoms that roams around causing havoc. Things like your, your H spots and all that. This is an outward indication of free radicals roaming your body. Okay, so what you want to do is have something that is able to control, absorb all these free radicals in the body. So it's on top of just simply helping with inflammation, getting good fatty acids to your body. You also want it to be able to absorb the free radicals that's causing havoc throughout the body. So herein comes the purple rice oil that's added to Sacha and Chi. That's why we come out with the name called balance all right we balance it and we find that now i think some of you if you have been marketing different products uh, over the years your friends have been introducing to you a lot of this at one time or another you like goji berry goji zi, uh, uh, mangosteen they even sell mangosteen products right pomegranate and all that archer berry power but look at all that in terms why they're doing that because at that time was this things are things that say it helps control free radicals Okay, among other things, other than the vitamin, in, inherent vitamins. But with balance, our combination of Sacha Inche and purple rice oil, this is a lab test huh? directly out. We find that the OREC measurement is that high, 99,000. This means it's very, very effective in destroying, getting rid of the free radicals in your body. Okay, that's one thing. And rich has got other function, but still, rich alone has got seventy two thousand. I'll go into exactly what the what the uh, uh, efficacy for each one of them does. All right. Okay, let's go on. Right again, there's something that's called phytosterol. Why? Phytosterol is basically good cholesterol sterol that's derived from plant, plant-based sterol. So in this case. It's either a and Che, we have got a purple rice, we have which um, look at this. So phytosterol, for the balance, you have got this amount, okay, versus flaxseed, 3,380 milligram per kilo of flaxseed oil. Olive oil, which is a fairly healthy oil, again, like say just now we saw in the chart that olive oil has got near to nothing, okay, very close to nothing, omega-3, it's a 1,706. Uh, apple, as in the fruit, or almonds, you know, your nuts, versus now our combination of sachet and chia and purple rice oil. Okay? Now, rich is the other, again, phytosterol. This is at 27. So it's extra virgin rice bran and germ oil. Again, why you want to do this? That all these are mechanically co-pressed. Does not require any adding of solvents for the extraction of the oil processing of the oil okay one thing two we also want to make sure that the acidity acidity is very low in our products how by ensuring that the moment we actually take the fruit uh, the nut out of the husk 
we must send it to the factory for cold pressing within three hours so that the nut itself does not oxidize. The longer you keep it in the air and open it oxidize, acidity level increases, right? Which also reduces the efficacy of the thing. So again, virgin cold press and quickly from fruit to factory to the oil itself and seal, right? Within a very short time to keep it fresh, okay? So same thing. Those people with the packet is nice because you can bring it everywhere. You want tear it up, you, you drink it. Those with the bottle, okay? And word of advice, do not leave it cold store for too long because once you open it exposed to air, it will start to also ox oxygenate, okay? Oxygenize, right? So very quickly, one. that's why it's 50 ml bottle, you, you finish it very quickly. So some people actually refills that 50 ml bottle with the 250 ml. Keep it away from light or so, too long. Don't have it kept under the sun, okay? So on. Balance rich, let's carry on. Health claims, plant sterile. This is important. Again, these are for people, vegans and all that. It helps them. And rich is also very rich in vitamin E. Eh? You know, ladies especially, very peculiar. You know, vitamin E is also very good for your skin. Okay? Actually, you would glow. So, balance. So, balance again has got almost a, like a 1 is to 1 uh, ratio of omega 3 and 6 plus now higher, much higher already. 0.5 ratio of omega-9 okay so we're adding so we're basically just improving the efficacy now some people what you do is that for the same for the same package price of 88.8 .8, right you get 85 packs of uh, sachin chip oil you actually can also go up for the 88.8 .8, one pack of uh, balance and one pack of rich each one of them has got 30 30 packs so if you take one in the morning, one in the evening, it's also a, equates to roughly one month supply. Sachi and Chi oil 85 packs means just more than one month of two packs. But alternatively, if you go for the balance and rich combination, it is one is to one daily, one month supply. Okay, and you got the benefit of this. Now, there are also, the, like say, the very, very minute percentage of nut allergic okay consumer who cannot who are totally allergic to a nut based product then they can still take our reach okay for people with a uh, balanced allergy which is such an shape then you can go on simply rich because again on a very high it's still good oil help you expect expel your bad oil get very high vitamin e and still very high removal of all your free radicals in your body Okay, free radicals are also the one that is also cancer causing and rich has been known, huh? a lot of tests come out, although we want to have see those uh, results before we want to publicly market it as such. Rich is very, 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 I use three very, uh, good for diabetic patient, patients. Okay, this is extremely good for diabetic patient. Uh, okay, this is this exactly, it controls your blood sugar. Okay, sorry, uh, you don't read Chinese, I'm doing that. Right, it reduces uh, free radicals, uh, improves your whole meto metabolism, etc. Okay, now, uh, okay, never mind. This, this chart here, this is actually an English one. Simply this, this is uh, Sacha and Chi oil. This is Sacha and Chi. This is balanced, this is rich, never mind. Omega 3, very rich. Green means good, huh? very high content. Omega 6, very high content. Uh, balance this uh, Sacha same thing three and six for the rich okay the omega three no not really but omega six all right M moderate right for omega nine now the rich is very rich now okay that's why why we wanted to you see we already have a Sacha and Chi that's very rich in omega three and six okay but then we added on purple rice oil to give you a very good balance between omega-3 ALA, yeah, supply of ALA, and a balance in the ability to remove free radicals, one. But omega-9 basically relies on your own body to produce most times. So we came up with rich, which is very, very rich in omega-9, okay? And then let's look at the, the, the phytosterol. Again, both of them are rich. And ORAC, the removal of free radicals, both of them are also rich, okay? Uh, especially rich is very good in our natural vitamin, 
okay, which is in this case vitamin E. Right? So at the end of the day, what you have, instead of having the goodness of just one single product, by this combination of uh, balance plus reach, we're providing you basically four, the, the efficacy of four different kinds of very good oil. Okay, so you can actually choose. Start off initially with just the Sacha Inche variety. And some people, what they do is that a lot of our uh, entertainment line friends, huh? uh, basically they do take this once in the day, I mean in the morning, balance, uh, rich in the evening, or it can be reversed. Again, because this is not medicine, huh? this is not uh, whatever, you have to take strictly this in the day, that in, in the night. You can also take a day, in a one day balance, like one, three, five balance, two, four, six, take rich. Okay, depend on your diet. This is dietary, right? And on and above this, they continue to take the Sacha and Che because they want the efficacy of more Sacha and Che oil. Okay, let's move on. So same thing, this is how you go about drinking that. So normally right now we say that this is, okay, this is Sacha and Che. Uh, once in the morning, once uh, in, you can combine this, uh, Sacha and Che in the morning, you can take that plus uh, 3 ml and then evening so on, you can take one day, one one day take balance, one day take reach, etc. Okay, or second day you can take also uh, balance and then reach, sort of like, sort of reverse it, no, no matter what you do, okay? So, depending on exactly how your body reacts to it, okay? But like say, for those people that is allergic to nut, then go on reach. At least there is there is a replacement for just a sacha and chick. Okay? What you need at the end of the day, no matter, regardless, your intake, your diet must have good oil. Let's move on. Okay, and this is this is basically now we combine uh, the research with one of the company, one of the largest supplier, even they supply even to the royal Thai family, right? Uh, one of the largest rice and uh, wheat grain supplier in Thailand to do this, okay? So, important thing is that we can actually control, same as with Sacha and Che. Sacha and Che, although it originated from the Peruvian, right? The Amazonian forest there. Eh? Right now, we have our own farms in Laos, okay? Just in ASEAN, in Laos. Grow it, we process it, we co-press it before it's packed, repacked in Malaysia and then dispute it, all right? Oh, these are all the guys. In fact, we'll like to, some of you will be able want to invite all of you to attend some of this. And this is, of course, during all the uh, the company trips. Okay, we did mention about there are certain trips throughout. And we can actually organize such trips to the manufacturing plant uh, for all disputers. Okay, uh, this is, uh, this guy is Perry. He's uh, the, the CEO, the president of the company. All right, so he personally actually goes down there help them harvest some of this, right? This is just not a photo opportunity. Uh, this is the uh, one of the owner of the plant in, in uh, Thailand itself. Okay, now this is actually all the Sacha and Chi. Okay, in the cultivated land. We control, now, we have to do this, why? To have our own. You simply cannot buy from major traders because they got con if they do, you buy from major traders, they control the price. We heard in this last year, last six months, the Koreans are snapping up such and shape. If you go to a Korean snack, Korean only sales shop, huh? you can now buy such and chi snacks. Okay, with such and chi oil. They sell the nut, you can use almost like a peanut. We sell a peanut, a packet of peanut, uh, almond and all that. The Koreans actually sell you packets of such and chi. Okay, because they also now understand the efficacy of this thing. Right. So the only way to ensure that we have got stability of supply and pricing is to have the farms. We control the farms ourselves. Okay. This is to control. It. This is gonna be a commodity like coffee beans. Practically, it has become that. So these are all the references, all the all the tests that they they gone on. Huh? Let's see. Okay. All right. So that's that's Bell and Rich. This is something to think about, go back. So in, in other than just Sacha and Chi, if today you're a first time here, you go back, you try a baguette, you drink. There's no fishy taste. In fact, some people get so used to the idea that that's why they also take so many more packets a day because they like the taste of that thing. Okay, it's a very nice nutty taste. 
all right? Unlike fish oil, which people, of course, refer to it as fishy. Okay, all right, that's one thing. And right now, what we're going to do is that we're going to introduce you to yet in our products. Because a lot. There's one other thing before I just bring on to that. We also have a new uh, distributor training, right? Orientation, uh, NDO, we call it. Uh, who are distributor bacteria, okay? Including your things, your E. coli and all that. Those things that we touch every day, right? That we do not know. Those with weaker defenses in your immune system, you straight away get, some of you will even get hepatitis B, for example, right? You get food poisoning. Uh, one of the, what, which are the things that you handle every day, you think, some questions that would be among the dirtiest? Money. Money? <laughs> what else? <laughs> no, examples, right? You think, just imagine money, obviously. Also, also you think? Shoes. 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 Okay. Toilet, mobile. Toilet, mobile phone. Okay. What else? Yeah. Those things that, sorry, yeah. you shake somebody's hand. Uh. Okay. Yeah, 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 yes. Yeah, yeah. Okay. The sorry. Door, door knobs. Okay. Uh, public right. Some handle on the public bus. Public, public bus door. handles, uh, obviously. Hawker center table. Hawker center. Table. Okay. <laughs> but you're not gonna use your bare hands and wipe it, right? Yeah. You take up tissue. Uh, wipe. They put your elbows. Off. Right. Yeah. What else? You think. Including things like, for example, your bed sheets, your pillow, yeah. and all that that you rest your head on every day, right? Yeah. Your computer keyboards, your mouse, and whatnot. Okay, we're, we're encouraging a lot of them. <laughs> okay, <laughs> plan like that. Okay, afterwards, uh, afterwards I'll tell you about that one. That, that's an amazing story. Okay, look at that. These are all from us. At one time in the papers, uh, both the Chinese, especially the evening Chinese papers, a lot of cases whereby got all of flesh eating bacteria. Right? Those are the super bugs that even sometimes in the hospital go with, with the strongest, right? A medicine you're not able to kill sometimes. So be careful. Okay, I'll see on that picture, but this is a real picture, huh? Skin like that. Fungi. Okay, this are. Uh, now you've got, let's say something that's like that exposed, especially things like your chopping board. Okay, happens your wooden chopping board. Eh? It's probably one of the most infected thing because of all the grooves and all that. I mean, it's very difficult to get rid of them. Eh? Now you've got something that's moldy, all right? Some food, eh? you say, try moldy, then you find you, can I have a, a fruit that's moldy already? Or never mind, I wash it, I shave off the skin, it'll be okay. No, never, straight away throw it. Anything that's gone moldy, throw it away instantly. Different kind of viruses again. Happy. At one time, there was a very, very major outbreak of hepatitis B in China, and they trace it all the way finally. You know what happened? Again, public transport, okay, like that, and every day. The Chinese, especially certain parts of China and certain province, they like to eat fun. <coughs> not just not that one, I can't oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Handle the, the, the bar in the public transport, other public bus or the uh, subway system. Straight go and take bun, eat. All got hepatitis B. Oops. Right? Really oops. We eat bun just now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> right? So basically, at the end of the day, things based, what you're saying is that all this germs, infection can come through to your nose, through your mouth, and whatever you touch. Okay? It's all airborne. Hand with mouth. This is, this is very, very recent. In fact, just last month. Okay, July 4th, this is uh, in Malaysia itself. Okay, this is a Malaysian Chinese uh, paper. Uh, uh, HFM, hand, foot and mouth. Okay, so major, major outbreak. In Singapore, it happens also, you know, it's not that infrequent. Huh? Once in a while, there's a cycle comes, it happens. So all our nurseries, all the daycare have to close, right? Disinfect the whole place. All the, all the kids stay at home. You know, you have to get domestic help because both the parents are working domestic help to look after them while the while the parents work. Okay? All HM, HFM. 12 states. All above the levels, alright, ever encountered recently. Now, let's look at this. In terms of microorganism, and I miss all the microbacteria organism on that, right? Highest in the list is your this sponge rack, okay, 
This is how many per gram, huh? Toothbrush holder. The one you, in your bathroom, you always put, stick it there, every day just use a bit of water, rinse, put on a toothpaste, brush and stick it back there, okay? Alright? Your pet bowl, okay? Your dog, your cat. Coffee reservoir, that one, the water, you just keep adding, topping up water. Too long, never go and wash it huh? with lemon or whatever. Uh, kitchen sink. Now all the way down, you think see toilet seat. So toilet seat is only two hundred sixty-six, while your toothbrush holder is three million. <laughs> right? Wow. Okay, all the way down, gear shift. I right, the money. car. Uh, money. Eight only. <laughs> Cleaner than my dishwasher. Cleaner than your dishwasher. <laughs> Cutting board, remover, you know, so on and so forth. Toilet handle. Okay, we think quite dirty, right? Yeah. But still 46. <laughs> so you, you never imagine that this one, okay, all this are uh, serious. You wanna take a picture, sir? Whoever wanna take a picture, go ahead. Because yeah? this one is not this one is not in the document uh, uh, folder that you can download. Right? Keyboard, keys. Let's put this way. Okay, look. One week, huh? This will be talking about bed sheet. Bed sheet, huh? The one you're now lying on every night. Okay? <laughs> In one week old, there's five million bacteria in right? Which is 24,000 times dirtier than your bathroom doorknob. And you're lying on it every night. Okay? In two, three, four weeks' time, it is 11.32 million, which is 5.4 times dirtier than that toothbrush holder. Okay, so what does this mean? Change your change your bed sheet more often, right? Unless you have some way to sort of you know regulate disinfected. Let's carry on. Below case. Wow, you step on your face and sometimes you wonder why your face itchy and all that. Okay, of course there are things like things like dust mites and all that, right? And I hope your house don't have big bugs, lah. Huh? That's a separate story altogether. But just bacteria, microorganisms, in one week. You're 17,000 times dirtier oh. than a toilet seat. Need a zen Okay, two weeks, 5.9, four set. And four weeks, I don't know, four weeks means one month you don't change your pillowcase. Huh? <laughs> it's 39 times dirtier than your pet bowl. Oh no. Oh no, oh yes. Okay, this is what this is all about. Right? So things like, again, your washing machine, if you don't wash it, right? Your refrigerator, just now we saw the things. Especially you keep buy, 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 store, you know, old food. You say, that thing can last three months in the freezer, you don't throw it away. Anyway, you're not going to eat it, right? And when times come, you think you can microwave it and eat it again. No, better get rid of it and get rid of, wash it. Right? That. Seco, ah, seco. <laughs> Make sure it's, you don't think seco, eh, looks okay, wa, ah, round, wash it, rid, and <laughs> it's still, you know, it's not, it's not deformed, it's still round, it's still round. wash it, you can eat, no, <laughs> throw, softer, okay, softer. just simply <laughs> dump it in a plastic bag, pull, wrap it up and all that, this has to be incinerated, <laughs> ah. <laughs> right, now, the problem is, you think that a lot of germs, a lot of germs, heat, we boil water and all that, we can kill it. Unfortunately, there are some super bacteria can last 280 degrees. Water boils at 100 degrees C. You think water boils? No, this guy can last. To me, no problem, it's just a suntan. <laughs> okay, at 280 degrees C, I can still survive, right? So, what is our answer to that? Okay, our answer is naturally, we combine Silver. You heard of stories? So called ancient Chinese emperors have always a silver pin. Right? The one insert into something, and if it turns black, you think that's poison. Okay? But actually, myth aside, silver is one of the best microorganism killer. Harmless to human, alright? But deadly, very, very deadly, right? To microorganism. The other, aloe vera. Aloe vera, there are hundreds of varieties. I think it lasted about 200 over documented. And only specific certain kinds of them, again, have that same principle. Okay, the ability 
to destroy microorganisms, uh, which includes your, your, your bacteria, your viruses. Tada! We came up with ISAP. Okay? ISAP is basically HOA Silver Aloe Vera Silver Aloe Protection. Okay? Guaranteed to wipe out 99.9%. .9%. Today I don't have that measurement uh, thing here. In fact, it was brought down. Basically, what we do is that we, if I just take any one of your hands, we swipe it. Okay? That means we actually take a right sample. We insert, we add a solvent to it. We can actually measure the number of microorganisms on that thing, on your hand, at any one time, okay? And only through the application, it could be hundreds of them reaching a thousand. Upon application of ISAP, eh, within five minutes, practically 99% has been wiped, okay? And for measurement, eh, this one is we find that someone who has sprayed it, eh, uh, uh, I think Mike himself sprayed it in 9 a.m. in the morning, by five, it's still protecting, okay? No, nothing cling on. Why? Because of the principle of aloe vera. Aloe vera is very smooth, it's very clingy, okay? Unless you use a lot of soap to, to really clean it off, it actually adheres to it, all right? And this is not what we're saying. So one thing to prove this true, you have to send it to a lab to do a test, okay? Few, few lab reports, huh? again, just saying. So they sent a uh, micro, uh, beer count. What happens is that you see it goes on different kind of these are all the different kind of bacteria E. coli, uh, Streptococcus, right? So on and so forth. After spraying, it's no longer there. Some of the results cannot be counted even. Okay, and the so on and so forth. All this here. Okay, this, uh, this is a blow up of just on that, that same picture. Look. Okay, so first you know, make sure that all the heavy metals are not there. Okay, two is that the bacteria, the different kind of viruses and bacteria itself, all the common ones are the ones that give you food poisoning, stomach upset, and whatever, right? Are all here gone. Then the other test thing here again, this is another laboratory because you, you can't just send to one, huh? we send to various laboratories after about five minutes. Okay, concentration, uh, this is uh, E. coli, uh, this is Streptococci. After about five minutes, uh, labs never put zero, uh, they put less than one, which is zero. Okay, same, five minutes, okay, the effectiveness, same, the other one, five, salmonella, very common, uh, you go and eat uh, uh, sushi, sashimi and all that, all right, if it's not prepared properly. Why you get food poisoning in a lot of kitchens, restaurants or hawker centres is that when they mix uncooked food and cooked food in the freezer, either accidentally or not or purposely. Okay? Ministry of Health sees that that things get locked down. Okay? They'll be suspended for two weeks, three weeks. Okay? That's exactly what the kind of germ. So again, within five minutes of application of ISAP, you have measurement is less than one. It is practically non-detectable. Okay. Well, again, this was this is a blow up of just now that particular test. Salmonella, uh, Streptococci, E. coli. Okay, very very common. So the the, the basically applications of this tool are the silver plus this particular breed of aloe vera would be all this. It can be uh, body sprays, anti-dandruff, uh, deodorants, gel, serum, spa products, men care, oral care. So they are just stating it lack from their factual point of view. Okay? The benefit is that you know it doesn't have all the bad chemicals there. No uh, paraben, no phenols, no oil base, low level use, eco. Now, very, very, very critically, of late, uh, especially in high tech industry. They always say we're using nanotechnology. For electronics, for high tech, okay, okay. Because by having nanotechnology, you actually increase the density. So your IC circuits within the same area, you can have so many more transistors etched into that same silicon wafer. So your CPU becomes more powerful. But when it comes to human consumption, you want to make sure that you don't have nano why? Because nano will penetrate into your skin, into the cell. Okay? 
So it's very, very dangerous. So again, we make sure our product is greater. So it's greater than 100 nanometer. So whatever apply for, it doesn't impact, go directly into your human cells. Okay, same thing. Huh? So next time, bear in mind, whatever you purchase and sell, especially those th people that claim that this one utilizes nanotechnology, it can be very dangerous. Right? So you have to control that. Huh? Whatever you queue, because the, the bacteria sizes are a lot larger than this. So whatever we apply to destroy those microorganisms doesn't have to be that small. And you have to make sure, ensure that it is larger than nanometer size. Okay, this is critical. In some countries, this becomes rule. I guess in Singapore, to a certain extent, for certain product uh, categories, this is also law. Right? You don't simply apply nanotechnology to everything and anything. Okay? Dangerous. Right? So it doesn't penetrate into your body cell. Now, all the while I'm talking about this, so this is not nanometer, huh? So, again, the breed, particular breed of uh, aloe vera that we choose has the ability to basically kill all the different kinds of microorganisms, including all the, all the different germs. Okay, here. That's it. Now, silver. Okay, what's silver? Silver basically prevents, uh, silver is very clever. Silver doesn't just kill, silver prevents the microorganisms from multiplying. It's like silver applied jue zi, jue sun. <laughs> Microorganism basically have to split. Alright? So the moment you, silver comes in, it penetrates inside the bacterial wall and destroys its ability to split. Okay, so we found one phenomena. Yeah, we found a phenomena when we specially spray, yeah. Go. When we measure immediately, shortly, in, within a few seconds after after we spray this, the number of microorganisms actually increase. You know why? The moment the microorganism detects that someone is trying to stop it, it first it, it furiously try to multiply first. But then right after that, the silver and the aloe comes in to take control. It just reduces almost down to zero. Okay, that is the reaction. It's a it's a it's a defense reaction of the bacteria of the viruses. You try to kill it, quickly try to multiply itself first, increase, and then finally it cannot defend itself. It just simply dies off. Okay, so something that is so deadly, okay? We claim 99.9%. Does this make this very dangerous that you have to be very careful your children should not be playing with this? <laughs> I can spray, it is totally harmless to human. Okay, we have one story, la, you know, a friend in uh, Indonesia, one of those nights, had food poisoning, not, not part of a member, uh, just a friend, had food poisoning from eating one of those Indonesian whatever seafood. Nothing, got no charcoal pills, got no whatever to relieve this problem. One friend was carrying this, he sprayed 10 times into his mouth. Okay, indeed, over the next one hour, he actually relieved his diarrhea problem. Okay, that was just one story. Uh. Again, do not sell this as a diarrhea <laughs> medication. It is not, okay? Come, you give your hand, you just try it. You're going to wipe on it after a while. It's very, it has a very nice, you just rub your hands, come. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's got a very nice feeling. It's almost like a, a, a body lotion. Very nice smell, nothing. Okay, protects you. And you know that you'll be bacteria free for the rest of the day. Okay, so no matter whether you're handling dollar bills or whatever, it's okay, it's safe. You can spray on your It's safe. Now, Chi this one, a lot of these indoor evergreen plants are sometimes very difficult to manage. Okay, you have to water it and all that. So this thing, again, because sometimes it's because bacteria infection and all that, mm -hmm. right? Prevents it, it turns brown, you've got different things growing on it. This thing was surviving only on ISEP. Mm -hmm. Because ISEP, more than 50% of it is water. water. Mm -hmm. More than 50% is water. So. This thing has been surviving on I set all this while as growing. So it's a very lucky plant. Alright, very expensive here. Okay. Yes. Okay. Right. How much? How much? Uh, 8880. Okay, wait. 8880. There's this, right? This one bottle, uh, this is uh 100 ml So you can actually check, you can actually carry on board, uh. 
the, the immigration officer, the custom officer won't go and take this and throw away. It's 100 ml. Okay, one. In the 8880, it basically comes with one of this bottle full already, plus another concentrated bottle that is 300 ml. Each one of them, you actually add uh, distilled water, one is to one ratio. So, which means that that will give you another six bottles. So, altogether, seven bottles. 8880, seven bottles, you add all together, how much is it? That's two cents. <laughs> Okay? If you do not mix, you want to use it concentrated, then it's four cents. <laughs> no, but for your safety, for safety, whatever child and all that, whatever touch, right? Food, uh, your, your things like your chopping board, whatever is there, you want to make sure it's safe, go. Okay? Now, just now I talk about not changing your pillowcases, your bed sheet, spray on it. Okay? Spray on it, right? To make sure that it's okay. Your toilet seat, toilet seat, at, even at home, not public toilet. Don't, don't get too kiasu. After that, the only problem worry about Singaporeans, we all say that. After you know about this one, then everything you go, you... It's like very rude. Right, wait, before you want to shake that person's hand. Huh? How do you do? Okay, I mean, it's nice, right? It's nice that people see you doing that, okay? But don't, don't get so kiasu that you have to do that, right? But before you sleep at night, right, just once, and not every night, huh? not every time before you lay your face on your pillow, your spray, no. Because it keeps, it's there already, it actually stops the microorganism from multiplying, okay? So, yeah, 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 yeah. Just, just probably missed it, missed it a bit, that's it. No, I think it's all wet, huh? then how are you going to sleep? No, no, we put a spray, gently, okay? Something like that will probably help, you know, not necessarily save life, but prevents a lot of, you know, inconvenience. Having problems, if outside you're not sure, huh? the plate and all that is very clean. Oh, most of the time, that's where we go other countries, right? They lay there and all that, forks and spoon. You also, you also kiasu already, must take your tissue, must wipe everything before you can use. Okay, you want to just add a bit. Things like your fruits, you leave in the open. Spray it, you'll be surprised. It keeps it very fresh. Because the thing will decay because of organisms, but over time, oxidation, right? This one actually keeps it fresh. Okay? And you just save it again. Again, it's, it's ISAP, it's already in stock here in Singapore right now. Can keep for how long open? No problem. It's, you, you can almost use it indefinitely. Uh, no, nothing is nothing. You can keep it indefinitely, almost like months. I mean, don't leave it out in the sun and all that. It's okay. Right? That's not what's open. It's actually, the, it's not sealed. Huh? There's no sealing. We even when you buy our box and all that, uh, do we have a sample of how it box look? Can I? Just show me one, I'll show them. Right? Anytime, yeah. Oh, you have? Oh, thank you. Come. Okay, uh, I, I won't destroy your box, don't worry, okay? Okay, this is, this is what one pack looks like. So this is 88, 80. So inside this box, you would have, slowly, yeah, don't destroy this box, okay. You would have both the, yep. Okay, you have both this. Yeah, just use my yeah, no, I mean, maybe we should still, yeah. It's just shrink wrap, okay? This one, already pre mixed up. Huh? And this, this is a concentrate, okay? What this simply this is, is that it is 3R ml. You just have to go to a supermarket to buy distilled water. Don't buy mineral water. Huh? Uh, don't buy all those, uh, what expensive, what mineral from which mountain, uh, no. Pure distilled water. So what you do is that after you finish this one, gone, you just pour half and add half distilled water. That's it. Okay, so this is 100 ml, this is 300 ml. So this is good for six more bottles. All right, okay. So, but don't be so careless, huh? now after you know about this, then everything is spray. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. So I mean, like say, we always like to say the things building. Right now, ultimately, every country will have our own uh, bacteria microorganism measurement meter because it's a laser system. It actually scans 
to see how many organisms is inside. And imagine we just go and swipe uh, a, a hand and you, you actually end up hundreds. So any, just that you and I have got a natural immunity. We are, most of us healthy people are protected. So we don't, you can really, right, eat. A lot of people touch this there and eat. But if your immune system happens to be low in that particular period, then we're in trouble. That's how you also get food poisoning, okay? Fish is half cooked and whatnot, right? I don't know, I mean, doesn't, does it mean that the next time you go out to consume sashimi, you're to spray on the fish. Spray sashimi. Okay. Yeah. So you don't have to don't have to do it. But anyway, it's it's good, right? It's safe to have one of this uh, at home. I, I basically I keep one right now. The one in my car is already like that that, that much. <laughs> of course, everyday spray so that on a steering wheel, you know, on the seat. Uh, KS a bit, huh? But so yeah, yeah. You know, your stick very smooth. Actually, it's a very nice feeling after that because it's almost smooth. Okay, it's, it's, the, it's a different feeling from applying such a inchi oil. <laughs> okay. Ah, sure. Does it kill the uh, pesticides? Kill pesticides? Because you put ah. some then they pesticides. No. Pesticides, is, pesticides and another chemical, right? pesticide is not alive, it won't be killed. Yeah. Okay, now, then the other people ask, does this kill cockroach or... <laughs> <laughs> no. 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 No, no. It doesn't kill the dust bites on your bed, uh, no. Uh. It's not killing a living uh, creature, right? Nothing. This kills the microorganism, the bacteria, the viruses, etc, etc. Okay, that's important thing. However, having said that, although it doesn't kill the cockroach, the mites and all that, the mites living ecosystem also depends on microorganism. It feeds on them. So you destroy the fella's food, the fella will also die. Okay? Ultimately. La. Okay? But you don't go chasing a cockroach and spray. You are wasting, huh? You're wasting your eyesight. Okay? Two cents, two cents, two cents, the first you don't die. Okay? So you remember that, yes. You put this one in the car, yeah. so when it's hot. No, no, that's why I keep out, it's out of the sun. Oh, okay. Look, you not, keep your dashboard. No, 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 no. Same thing, okay. A lot of you, I think some are especially busy. Uh, this is something I should warn you. You are busy distributors, you, you collect, come here, collect goods, what, 10 boxes, no time to send a friend. You can keep that thing in the boot of your car, try not to. If you don't have time to deliver, keep it at home first. The long, because the heat, eh, yeah. it oxy oxidizes the oil, eh? it's not good at all. Okay, because the temperature can go high in your boot. Like say, although the oil, doesn't steam, okay, can withstand up to 280 degrees C. But omega 3 is it gets stuck to get disintegrated at about 70 degrees. So you want to keep it fresh. Okay? Remember that. Same thing here. This one just keep in your car and all that. You come, you know that something is dirty, just bring it along. Right? It's not I don't know, maybe ladies' handbag you can have it inside your thing, like, but don't have to be KS. Like, you go. If you actually it's a very but it's a very comforting thought. Now, ladies, you go to public toilet at least can save. <laughs> save, very safe, right? You don't worry about any other thing. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh, I think what we example we go to NTUC whatever buy very cheap. Uh, yeah, one bottle. Bottle water. Bottle water will do. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. Just distilled water. Play. Just pure filtered distilled water is the best. Yeah. 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 Battery Actually, it's same as battery water, but then sounds a bit <laughs> risky. <laughs> battery water. Yeah, I mean, battery water actually is distilled water, right? But those, of course, for human consumption, theoretically, is tested safer, la. safer. Yeah, those for, that you buy off the ah, uh, that you can purchase off the NTUC fair price shelf for cold storage or whatever. Yeah, like that. Ah, uh, this is distilled water. Okay. How much is it? This how much? Sixty cents. Seventy cents. Yeah. Okay, so one of this, this is what? This is 500 ml. If I don't keep for five months, lah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but you can, you can, you can mix. That means this one alone can mix five bottles, sorry. Uh, yeah, 50, 50, 50, 6, uh, 500 ml. 10 bottles. Uh. Okay, so don't lah. Uh, you just mix one, just drink it. <laughs> so you can have fresh one, okay? It, there should not have any smell one. Uh. Okay, unless of course you use something after a lot, you use if your water okay, 
question back to your question can you use whatever boiled water and all that of course you can right but because it's not pure if there's still some organism inside I mean you're just mixing it up you're trying to kill it so over time it may smell a bit may I'm saying right but it's okay again you just simply as long as water you go and uh, do a, add a mix of one is to one and that's it voila that's it okay so very simple so 60 cents one right just buy this uh, don't buy battery water lah. okay so it's pure distilled water, drinking water uh, I don't know new water <laughs> oh, shit. New water is not yeah it's New water, in fact, is filtered like especially okay, in the special membrane osmosis, you know, reverse osmosis filtering. Okay, so again, use distilled water, right? Let's see if we got. That's it. So, ninety nine. This is true. Huh? this is tested, lab tested, and we have, we actually bought the measurement uh, instrument to prove it. Indeed, it's true. Okay, every one of you. So from now on, be safe and to be sorry, but don't have to be. Uh, no scary cat lah, everything spray here, spray there. Okay, it's not nice. Alright, so